I do any more editing today, I think my brain is just gonna explode. My sunglasses are on. I need to go outside. Okay, so that did not work well at all. Got an Uber, went to a park that is close by, so I was like, this is LA. I'm gonna find a trail. I'm gonna be all cool and hip and happening and climb up a really tall hill and take a picture at the top. But I got dropped off in a really weird location and by the time I actually found a trail to walk up, I had to leave because I have a meeting super soon. So I think this place has a gym in it. Guys, I haven't worked out in over three months, but I'm like dedicated to changing. I doubt I'll even make it a mile on the treadmill. We'll see. So that was absolutely horrible in the best way possible. I lasted 1.5 miles, which ugh. It is a beautiful LA night. Like the weather here, guys, it's just so LA how beautiful it is. I am here this week to attend a conference called Yellow Conference and I'm on a panel, I'm doing some Snapchatting so that'll be super fun and I'm here at a dinner with some speakers and people who are a part of the conference. So far, we're explaining pop sockets. Okay, what's cool too is you can pop it out and also go like that, and it can be a stand. Oh, see, and you can watch your Netflix. <laughs> How do you feel about the pop socket? It's amazing. I'm like terrified of the selfie, and so like this could like on my selfie game. This could be a game changer for the selfie. Yes. No. You've never. No. I didn't vlog like at all today. There's a lot of great people in LA. I would never live here, but it's always such a great place to visit, meet people, connect. Okay, see, this is awkward. It's like 11 p.m. I didn't film a lot today. I don't know if like, is today vlog worthy? Hmm. Guess we're gonna see. Wait, I do need to go to CVS. Dang it, I forgot to go to CVS. You wanna come, you wanna come to CVS with me? Might be an adventure. Welcome to Walgreens. Welcome to Walgreens. Okay, lesson learned from that. Girls shouldn't walk around downtown LA at 11 p.m. at night. The vibes were sketchy, very sketchy. What an exhilarating trip to CVS. Walgreens. I do have a question to pose to you guys. I'm always talking at y'all. Now it's time for you to give me some advice. So I'm going to be honest in that really ever since I dropped out of college, which was, oh my gosh, was eight months ago. Ever since December, 2015, I have been all about that hustle life, all about the hustle, all about the grind making, building, creating, just all about it. In the sense of making videos, making connections, doing whatever I needed to do at whatever rate possible to get where I wanna be. I literally have zero regrets. I am so thankful for all the opportunities, all the people I've met along the way, all the opportunities that I've made for myself. And it's just been so amazing. And honestly, it's been the coolest thing to have an audience to share it with you guys, hanging out with you guys. I've never been a crazy health freak or anything, but I'm not dumb. Any human knows that it's important to sleep. It's important not to eat crap all the time and it's important to stay active. Honestly, living in New York City has helped out with the being active part, but I just, I used to work out a lot and take care of myself and I've reached this point where I think I really need to get back on that train and really need to get back to 
sleeping and see I say that but I've never really had like a sleep schedule I mean ever since high school in high school I was always super worried about my studies I was really involved with music and guitar and stuff with like band stuff and so I was always super dedicated to school staying up studying but then always doing the music thing and so I don't know, I've never really been on a good sleep schedule ever since freshman year of high school. I'm in this point where how how do you get on a schedule? How do you get on a flow or back into a flow when you've never really even been in a flow? I have never like I was I was thinking about it. I've never had a set routine when it comes to sleeping, when it comes to really anything. Anyways, I'm rambling and I want to get to my point. My point is the hustle is important, the grind is important, and it's gotten to me where I am today. And there's certain phases of your life where you just kind of have to say, screw sleep, let's do this. Um, but then there's other phases of your life that you have to realize that the hustle is affecting the hustle. When you're going, going, going and not taking care of yourself, then that affects how you work and how you do things. So that's kind of where I'm at right now. And so I want to know what are some things that you guys do that maybe helps you get in a good sleep routine or good eating habits? How do you stay in the gym? How do you stay fit? I want to pick your brain. I'm being selfish and I'm now saying, okay, audience of thousands of people who watch me, give me all of your tips or life hacks on sleep, health, eating, working out, anything that you got for me, please tell me. Cause I, I don't know, I kind of want to get serious about getting my person together cause I think there's, you know, a lot of benefit to it. Anyways, speaking of sleep, guess what I should be doing right now? I should be sleeping. But please leave a comment down below. I want to pick your brains about this stuff, so. Until next time, stay peachy. Okay, bye. I'm currently working on uh, building a hotel chain uh, from scratch.